Let's imagine a, a not-so-distant future where your car is not just a means of transportation, but also a symbol of innovation and technological power. The Cybertruck schematics not only raise questions about Tesla's vision, but also about the mysterious plans behind the front-wheel drive variants. This suggests that Tesla not only wants to change the way we get around, but also the way the auto industry operates. What advantages will the front-wheel drive system bring to the Cybertruck? Join us in today's Techstars episode. Click the subscribe button to stay updated with our exciting videos as we aim to reach 800 subscribers. Now, let's dive into today's content. While welcoming its much-anticipated electric truck, Tesla introduced three distinct variants, a single-motor rear-wheel drive, a dual-motor all-wheel drive, and a tri-motor a WD to meet various financial requirements and preferences. How does the integration of the front-wheel drive system in Tesla's Cybertruck impact its pricing? Ford is currently facing a shortage of F-150 Lightning trucks at its dealerships. In contrast, GM is encountering difficulties in finalizing the Ultium battery technology, significantly delaying the delivery schedule of the Hummer EV. Meanwhile, Rivian, a new contender, is now emerging as the leading force in the electric pickup truck market, having successfully delivered 14,374 R1T models in the past quarter, surpassing the sales of the more expensive F-150 Lightning by more than 4,300 units. However, the demand for the Cybertruck in the U.S. market seems relatively weak. The initial excitement over the prospect of a price below $40,000 appears to be fading. Nonetheless, a positive signal comes from Tesla's plan to introduce a front-wheel drive variant of the Cybertruck, which may drop below the $30,000 mark, a $10,000 reduction from the initially projected price. Significantly cutting production costs and integrating the front-wheel drive implies that Tesla's Cybertruck manufacturing plants can optimally arrange the assembly parts, reducing production costs and the overall weight of the vehicle. This weight reduction allows for more efficient material use. With just one month left until the delivery date, although the price is yet to be determined, confidence in a reasonable price is entirely justifiable. Tesla seems to have carved out a unique niche by venturing into the front-wheel drive system within the pickup truck category. This strategic move signifies a new chapter in the automotive industry, highlighting Tesla's leadership and innovation. What advantages could the implementation of front-wheel drive offer for the Cybertruck? Integrating front-wheel drive capability into the base variant of the Cybertruck could substantially enhance the vehicle's performance. Particularly, it would significantly improve towing capacities, maneuvering through challenging terrains and handling heavy-duty tasks. The implementation of the front-wheel drive system plays a vital role in enhancing the Cybertruck's overall characteristics. According to details from a document released by the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration, the Cybertruck's weight rating is delineated through the Gross Vehicle Weight Rating categories G and H. While these categories don't provide an exact weight, they imply that the vehicle's weight could hover around 7,000 pounds, potentially exceeding 8,000 pounds for certain variants. The front-wheel drive system contributes to reducing the vehicle's overall weight and it's generally simpler and lighter compared to dual-motor all-wheel drive or rear-wheel drive configurations. As a result, the Cybertruck might be lighter, potentially around 6,300 pounds. Comparing the weight of vehicles under the front-wheel drive configuration, the Rivian R1T has a GVWR of 8,532 pounds, which is 2,232 pounds, more than the Cybertruck. Similarly, the F-150 Lightning weighs between 8,250 to 8,550 pounds, surpassing the Cybertruck by over 2,250 pounds. The GMC Hummer EV pickup is rated at 10,550 pounds, indicating a weight difference of 4,250 pounds compared to the Cybertruck. These weight comparisons highlight a consistent trend with other vehicles typically weighing around 2,000 to 3,000 pounds more than the Cybertruck when equipped with the front-wheel drive system. The undeniable advantage of the Tesla Cybertruck's weight becomes apparent in this context. This weight advantage positively impacts the vehicle's performance and efficiency. Implementing the front-wheel drive system results in enhanced performance, 
primarily due to the reduced vehicle weight. This decrease in weight is poised to contribute to improved fuel efficiency. Initially estimated to produce around 800 horsepower, the model could potentially reach 850 horsepower or even more, with a torque of 1,000 lb Ford. The reduction in vehicle weight might allow for quicker acceleration from 0 to 100 chem h in just 2.7-2.8 seconds, a marginal cut of 1-2 seconds, but with a substantial impact on the vehicle's overall power. Integrating the front-wheel drive system into the Cybertruck involves positioning the engine at the front of the steering axis, which focuses more weight on the front wheels. This strategic configuration offers enhanced traction, potentially improving the Cybertruck's performance on slippery surfaces. Additionally, it aids the vehicle's towing capacity, which was previously rated at 14,000 pounds, approximately 6.3 tons, and might even increase to 15,000 pounds. This application of the front-wheel drive system becomes highly beneficial, particularly in environments subjected to cold climate testing, like in New Zealand, and challenging terrains where Tesla has conducted trials. The implementation is optimized to boost performance and efficiency in varied driving conditions. The increased interior space of the Cybertruck due to the utilization of a front-wheel drive system results from a simplified design of the drive shaft and rear axle, making the truck's floor flatter and widening it by about 82 inches. The truck bed's interior width is anticipated to be at least 65 inches, with a crucial aspect being a minimum of 49 inches between the wheel wells. This configuration allows for the transport of materials up to 5 feet wide without requiring them to be placed on the wheel wells. What are your thoughts on this change in the Cybertruck? Feel free to share your opinion in the comments below. What significance does applying a front-wheel drive system in the base variant of the Tesla Cybertruck? The initial choice of the rear-wheel drive variant offering a 400 cam operational range per charge, accelerating from 096 cam slash h in about 6.5 seconds and reaching a maximum speed of 175 cam slash h certainly aligns with the Cybertruck's utility for towing and transporting heavy cargo. The rear-wheel drive system provides strong pulling power and effective weight distribution, essential characteristics in traditional truck designs. However, revelations from diagrams regarding the Cybertruck's drivetrain, brought to light by Tesla's prominent journalist Green Thee Only, hint at a potential shift towards a front-wheel drive system. This seems contrary to Tesla's initial commitment to provide a truck capable of handling heavy-duty tasks effortlessly. This action could raise doubts about the vehicle's capabilities and possibly impact pre-orders or future sales, especially for a highly anticipated vehicle like the Cybertruck. Tesla has built its brand based on innovation and promoting durable, high-performance vehicles. Any alterations here, particularly for a highly expected product like the Cybertruck, could significantly impact the brand's image. As anticipation for the official release of the Cybertruck continues to increase, the demand for transparency from Tesla to explain the change in the diagrams becomes more pressing. This will ensure consumer trust and meet the high expectations for the Cybertruck. What are your thoughts on the potential application of the front-wheel drive system in the Cybertruck? Are you expecting this to happen? And that's the end of today's episode. We sincerely thank you for watching today's video and for your support of our Techstars channel, as always, if you like our videos, please leave a like, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and ring the bell to stay updated on exciting developments in the world of electric vehicles. We hope to see you again next time. Until then, be careful and safe.